I always feel like, you know, what's going to be the next big feature for foldable, flippable phones are, that are going to make them special enough for someone to go ahead and pick it up? Because if you realize most foldable, flippable phones nowadays, they're almost to a point where it's like a copy and paste across the board. Now, I think OnePlus did a great job of re-releasing the Oppo Find N3, which is, you know, kind of the own spin on foldable phones. But even then, I mean, you look at that phone, compare it very closely to the Google Pixel Fold. For the longest time, it was copy the Galaxy Z Fold and Flip series, and that's all you had to do to be successful. So with all that being said, I think it was even, I forget what CEO it was. One of the CEOs of the tech companies even said that it gets to a point now where it's almost impossible to be new or brand new in any way with foldable flippable phones because everyone has done any everything you can do. Well, Xiaomi, Xiaomi is deciding to change that. Because now they're adding a new thing to their fold, no, well, their first flippable phone ever. And that's going to be the Xiaomi Mix Flip. It was spotted at a Chinese certification website. The listing suggests that the phone will be equipped with satellite connectivity. So obviously this changes a tad bit of, you know... There's a couple monkey wrenches in there, so now you don't have to worry about it just being your own, you know, internet, or sorry, your own service provider. Let's say, for example, you're lost in the middle of the woods, or you're lost in a, you know, the Grand Canyon, I don't know why that would be an example. But let's say you were, and you had no phone service, well, you now can connect to a satellite and actually make a call, SOS call, and actually save yourself. So... I know there are some people who still probably rock satellite phones in general. I'm talking about the old-fashioned satellite phones. But now that you have this connectivity feature on the new Xiaomi Mix Flip, will it be a sellable feature? The iPhone, by the way, also has the new iPhone 15 Pro Max and 15 Pro. I think all the 15s have this exact same feature, satellite connectivity. Will this be a huge feature that will sell this phone? I would say it like this. No, I don't think it will be the huge feature that sells this. I think it will sell plenty fine because Xiaomi has a huge market in China. And I think a lot of people are fans of Xiaomi's phones in China. So I think that they will sell a lot of this product for that said reason. But I don't think that this is going to be something where, let's say they went international with this phone that would really spark up a lot of talk slash buzz and get people to buy it. Because while, yes, it's cool to have a satellite-connected phone, I don't think it's at a point where people are going to be like, wow, this is a feature I need to have on my phone. Because, again, while, yes, in the moment that you are stranded in the middle of nowhere and you need this feature more than anything... The amount of times people are stranded in the middle of nowhere without any phone connectivity, usually the average person is zero or less than one percent, right? So it's one of those features where it's like it's a cool thing to have, but unless you're in a situation where you need to have it, then it's kind of a useless feature, I feel like. Like, it's not a feature that people talk about on their day-to-day -day lives. Like, hey, by the way, guess what? My phone has wireless charging and 120 hertz displays. Well, guess what? My phone can connect to satellite, and if I ever get trapped in the middle of the woods or the wilderness, I can call and get SOS help. So, like, it's one of those interesting type features that I feel like it's cool to have, and it's a cool extra feature add. But if that's your major feature that's a big deal, I don't think many people are going to pick up your phone just because of that feature. I don't think that's a selling point in any way. And I might be completely incorrect, and you can comment down below and tell me if I'm incorrect here, or if this is actually a selling point for you. Would you pick up this phone based on the fact that it is a satellite phone, and you can make calls and... If you're in the middle of nowhere and you have no service, you have the ability to at least go get SOS help and come save you. For the one person who probably used a satellite phone before when they were in the middle of the woods trapped 
they're probably going to comment down below. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.